I just watched the episode. Hands down, the best episode I've seen. Enjoy the reaction. Whenever they show a bird, I get worried. Why do I feel like I've never seen a baby in this show? That's Aaron. Don't tell me that's Grisha. Don't- No, that's fucking Grisha. What?! Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh shit! They're visiting the, the the past, memories of the future. Oh my god! What's gonna happen this episode, man? What is Zeke gonna show Aaron, or is Aaron showing Zeke stuff? Nando. Oh, I miss Mama Aaron. She's a milf. Uh. Oh shit. What was that? Why do you look at him like that? Oh my god, dude. Dude, does Grisha see them? Nah, nah. They're, they're like visiting. I've seen this in like Game of Thrones and stuff where they visit the past. But they could also make a disturbance since they're visiting the past. A way to connect with their past selves or, or history itself. So I wonder if somehow they could communicate to each other. Why do I feel like this is going to be the best episode I've ever watched? Already I'm like in disbelief. God. 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 He's an asshole who tossed his family into a ditch to restore Eldia. He just casually called his father an asshole. That's why he's daddy. I don't believe you, Aaron. This motherfucker is lying. My asshole. <laughs> Zeke, you're, you're tripping, bro. Come on. You don't believe this, don't do you? Zeke, young boy. Come on. He's lying. I don't believe Aaron at all. This is one of those episodes where the soundtrack is just gonna keep going on and on. I'm gonna come. What the fuck? Oh, Hannes. Oh, I miss Hannes. I miss these simple times. Look at them just sitting up there. They're visiting like every moment of the show. They're like us. This is gonna be me rewatching the show. Oh, shit, man. Oh my god, not the church. What? He discovered it this long ago? Holy shit. <laughs> Zeke, bro. I feel bad for Zeke. Doesn't know what the fuck is going on. Something's going on right now. This is sus. That's why he didn't attack them right then and there. He went back home to hug his child. He doesn't want to do that. I mean, the Buddha guy? I mean, you're asking him to do a lot in this mission. Like, he has to kill the king and all of, this, all of the king's children and stuff. That's a lot to ask for, buddy. buddy. No, no! <laughs> oh my lord, and oh shit. This episode is already. It's getting close to my number one episode. The number one episode where um Jaeger, where the original Aaron Jaeger, Aaron um Kruger, told Grisha about Mikasa and Armin, and they were like, oh, who are they? This is getting close. It's getting close. I love anything involving time travel. With Ed, this show into the mix? Oh my god! Ah! <laughs> Memories of the future. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. I'm not going to be able to handle this episode. He's going to betray you again, buddy. Why? 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 Why is this show so fucking good? Why? For, for, for what reason? For why? I just don't understand. I will say this again and again. You Japanese people, I don't know what you're taking, but you better import it some way over here because I need it. 
No, you wait. You're telling me you're him? This is everything I've ever wanted in a show. Look at this. Look at this shit. These, these fucking Japanese people are insane, bro. Dude. I, I can't read all this. Oh, shit, Aaron. Aaron's so soulless. He's roasting himself. Oh, fuck. That was beautiful. That, that was top five right there. That was top five. Aaron, season four has been nothing but soulless and heartless. We've been trying to understand him and why he's being like this. What has he seen? What does he know? And now he's revisiting his past and he's looking at the moment where his life really changed. When he saved the Mikasa, this is where everything changed. Given her his scarf. Look at this. Look at him looking at her like just just second guessing, just thinking about everything. I, I, I can't say that. Like I don't know for sure, but just him just looking at her. I love how he's saying this while he's looking at kids. See before I save the world, I wanna save you. Zeke, your heart's too big, buddy. I don't think Aaron gives a fuck about you. The key! What the fuck was that?! Don't do this to me. It's like Aaron noticed that Zeke was able to connect with Grisha, like Grisha saw Zeke somehow. So Aaron now activated that, or now we know he, he's, he understands that he can connect with Grisha from the past. So now he's taking control, like Grisha doesn't see, I mean, uh, uh, um, Zeke doesn't see Grisha right now, how, how he, he doesn't see that Grisha sees Aaron. The way they're positioned. I'm back to oh my God. I'm gonna fucking cry, man. So, so, so does he see them? Does he see the both of them? This is the day he leaves. <laughs> Yo! What, what's with Zeke's face, man? Oh my god, the way Aaron is positioned between Grisha and little Aaron. As if Grisha doesn't want to say this stuff. But he sees, he knows Aaron's right there. He's right beside him, older Aaron. So he knows he has to say something different. Like he has to say something that puts this future into, into fruition. <laughs> this is why he walked out like this? I gotta rewatch this whole show. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the greatest episode. What the fuck? Aaron is positioning himself in these past memories in a way where Zeke can't see him communicating with his father. Like he can't see these ex expressions. Look at Aaron's position and look where Zeke is. Like they can't totally see what's going on. The basement and the cage just got a million times more important to me. Oh my God, thank God I got it tatted on me. Oh my Lord. This is the day. This is the day he takes the founding Titan. Grisha, your voice actor, whoever you are, I said it in my last video, I'll say it again. You are probably the best voice actor I've heard so far in anime. I, I can't believe it. The amount of emotion that comes out of this guy's mouth, I can't even talk like that if my parents are being slaughtered in front of me. Y'all done fucked up. Y'all done fucked up. You're a stupid bitch. Oh, man. Grisha knows that because she's saying this, he knows what he has to do now. 
That's why he's panicking. You once said you saw this memory and were disgusted with it. Oh my, wait a minute. He just said you once said you saw this memory and you were disgusted with him. And then Zeke looked over to Eren and noticed Eren was disgusted with him. So it's like Eren told him and Zeke is living in this memory now. Zeke has no control of what's going on. Eren is in full control. Eren... Zeke is in Aaron's head right now. Zeke is revisiting the past. This happened already. Do I have to keep saying how good this guy is? Those horns. Oh, I can't wait for this motherfucker in the back to get slaughtered, bro. Just something about his face. Even a guy on the right, bro. Ugh, just murder him. What a fucking idiot. Yo! Yo, he sees him! He sees him! <laughs> My heart is racing right now. The fucking tension. The anger. The anger in that fucking face, man. Grisha felt that presence. Look at him. Look, he felt that fucking presence. <laughs> Oh, oh, even Zeke, even Zeke knows. Oh, man. Oh. What is Aaron doing? What is Aaron doing? Oh! Zeke didn't know that! I don't think anybody knew that. I don't think Zeke knew that. Mirai, you're a Yo, this every nose! Zeke, they're gonna. Yo! <laughs> Eren knows all about this. Yo, the fucking tension. What the fuck is this noise? I feel like a volcano's about to burst. <laughs> How you're bound by the vow renouncing war. You can't fully use the bound of Titan's power either. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. Come on, Grisha. Wait, did he just change the, the future? Because this is the first time he's seeing this? Yo, no way! Did he just change the future? Oh my god, this show! This goes two ways right now. Eren influences him. Or two, he changes the future somehow right now. Because this is the first time in this memory. I This show, either way it goes, it's gonna go somewhere fucking in insane. Oh, uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. No, 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 no! What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> the fucking Didn't I just say, like two minutes ago, how amazing this voice actor is? Do you fucking hear this guy panicking right here? Alright, so I am gonna say it. So far, out of every anime I've watched, that ha was my favorite scene. That, that was it. That was it. That's number one. Oh my god, just. Eren's. Oh! Eren, this is what Eren saw when he kissed. Well, he got spoiled! He saw the fucking spoilers! It all makes sense now. It all makes fucking sense. This is why he's changed since that moment. That's why he's changed since the beginning of season four. This is what he saw. It was all answered in this episode. Oh my god, Eren. Cause this. Look at this fucking shit. This guy deserves a Grammy. This guy deserves a fucking Grammy for his voice. Oh! Oh! 
しょうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。I'm fucking out. I'm. I. Uh, I'm squirting. At the fucking music. He was in charge the whole time!